Hey guys, on today's video, I'm gonna show you quick tips on how to use this, right? So this is a real tutorial of how to use this. Just really quick, basic tutorial. So your water, first of all, let me just um, teach you guys where the water goes. So the water goes right here. Just push this up, and then you guys can put in water. Here it's gonna tell you up to how much water you should put, and that's it. Right now I have this much water, that's fine. You guys don't need to put water right away if you're gonna iron uh, with no Okay, so with no steam, then you guys don't need to put water. If you guys are gonna use steam, which I suggest doing so, so it's faster, just uh, put some water in there. Um, also, if you put water, this becomes a little bit, you know, with more weight, and that's a good thing, generally. All right, so, um, main setup. All right, so, we're gonna take this out. So the cord just comes out like this, right? And you guys can just press this you know, for the cord to go back in. Now, obviously that's not always gonna work so once you press it out and it's not going back in let's say you guys can just take the cord and kind of go like this help it go in okay but slowly all right so we're gonna take it out all right we're gonna plug it in and this is what's gonna happen all right so it's gonna be enough and make sure make sure once you're done doing this always bring it back to off and then disconnect it don't just disconnect it, all right? So, we're gonna take a look at this. For most of you, your setting would be at cotton for everyday use, most of you. Not everybody, but there are other settings. So right now, we're gonna set it to cotton. So all you guys have to do is press set twice, you're gonna see this, it's gonna start blinking. Now, that means it's getting ready, all right? It's not hot enough yet. Once this stops blinking, that means it's hot enough and you guys can start ironing, all right? Now this up here, while we wait for this to get all set up, so it's gonna blink, and once it becomes a steady light, then you guys should use it because it's all ready. So, um, to use this, all you guys have to do, all right, the steam, this is zero, middle, and then max. For most of you, you're gonna use it around there for everyday use. So I use it usually around there for my pants, um, t-shirts and stuff, usually cotton, although I'm not. You know, I'm using, let's say, maybe jeans, I'm ironing jeans. I'm still gonna use the cotton setting. Um, that's just my pre personal preference. But you guys could use another setting for sure. I find that cotton setting's pretty high up there, so it's good enough for jeans. And usually I don't use steam when I do jeans or t-shirts. Um, other than that, I always use something like that for a setting right now. Um, so as you can see, it beeped. It's a steady light, it's ready to go. All you guys have to do is start ironing, all right? So I'm not gonna teach you how to iron, but some steam will come out. And of course, as we press this, you guys will see more steam coming out. Okay, so if you bring it up, you'll see the steam, right? So, now let's say you guys want a lot of steam. No, for most of your settings, um, for most of your, let's say, your pants, you want it to be steamed like that. Well, once you hit a portion where you want to a lot of steam come out then you guys can press this all right and that's gonna do this okay um, other than that uh, what other settings really common well most of you guys won't use the spray but that's that's how it works um, I usually just do steam not really spray but any anyways other than that this is the really basic stuff I'm teaching you guys right now basic setting the other things I'm not really gonna go through them because that's just depending on what clothing you guys are ironing other than that you guys should bring this down to off and then disconnect it so try not to just disconnect it when you're caught in it's not gonna explode nothing's gonna happen it's not gonna break however that's what the manual says, so might as well follow it, right? Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.